Hermit. Things are getting better. We did it. Pathfinder Ryder did it. Need something? I should get going. Stars be bright for you, Pathfinder Ryder. How can I help? You said something about Angar and fanatics here? Yes. Avar is home to the Rokar. They are... hardliners. The Ket invasion has made them hostile to all aliens. Be prepared to defend yourself. Did you know about Havarl's decline? Most Angara say that ruin is a long way off. There are Dara on the other side of the planet, where it's still safe to live. But maybe not for much longer. I have to go. We'll speak again later. Of course. I'll be here. Good to see you again, Pathfinder. Mithrava and the Sages. Tell me more about that. We don't know much. They limit their interactions with everyone else. Even when they need to trade, they say very little. They think that by keeping apart from us, they'll preserve the integrity of their legends. Before you got caught in that stasis field, Kieran says you were studying the monolith. What did you learn? There's a vault here. When the scourge hit, it took down some functionality. But now that all monoliths are active and the vault reset, Haval's problems should come to an end. We can speak more later. I'll be here. Kieran says Haval would have blasted another psycho. Two at most. Were the projections so dire? I could believe it. We came so close to losing everything. Jal says Evra is waiting for your call, Pathfinder. Pathfinder, you have new email. The discovery of Aya was just what we needed, Ryder. The Angaran scientists have been so generous in sharing their wisdom. It's been amazing. At least one of the first contact situations went well. <sighs> right. The Ket. Habitat 7. I'm thankful the Angara were willing to risk working with us. I'm afraid not all of them are quite so friendly. Some give trust easily. From others, you have to earn it. 
I'm confident we'll get there. I should get back to things. Sounds good. Gil, O'Connell and Serena spent months getting our systems coordinated. You can't just strip and redesign those connections on the fly. Gil? I know you can hear me. The whole ship can hear you. I'm just not listening. You're fighting again? I'm thinking the same, believe me. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. Gil? You missed your appointment. Again. Uh-oh, someone's in trouble. I had a good reason. Which was? When I remember it, I'll tell you. I don't think she bought it. The Angara were super curious about the ship. A few were pretty bold. Asked me questions. What do you make of them? They know their shit. Quick-minded, sharp. They'll make good allies. How's your friend Jill doing? Good. Busy. Apparently, prepping multiple species for procreation is a lot of work. Who knew? Waiting to get it all started was killing her. Now she's being shot out of a cannon, so to speak. Out with it already. What's the deal with you and Kalo? Anything I should be concerned about? Ah, uh, twist my arm, why don't you? It, it's contrasting styles more than anything. He's a blueprint guy. I'm gears and guts. Got ink on his digits, not grease, up to his elbows. If you didn't have me to balance him out, you might be in trouble. <sighs> Heck, maybe that goes both ways. Regale me with some poker wisdom. <laughs> well, bluffing and reading players aside, Poker is all about math. If the odds of getting the card you need are greater than the bet, make the bet. Good talking to you, Gil. Anytime. Yes? How do you think the crew is holding up? I'm happy to share what I can without violating patient confidentiality. Anyone in particular? I sort them in their files, and my brain, by species. Is Jal doing okay? He's adjusting. The rest of us have at least some understanding of each other's cultures. But to Jal, we're all outsiders. It's a lot to take in. I'd say he's doing pretty well. 
Thanks for the insight. I'll let you get back to it. I'll be here if you need me. Pathfinder, you have pending vid calls. Commander? Pathfinder, Joel's been keeping me updated on your adventures, your good deeds on our behalf. I meant them. I want you to know you can trust me. You went out of your way to free that science team. A selfless act. But your true agenda is clear. To explore Aya's vault. Joel says you want to help find the Moshai. Why should I let you? My personal code is... I got this. Bold. A little arrogant. Like me. Still, I'll reserve judgment for now. We've managed to trace the Moshai to a special Kent facility on Vold. Why special? These facilities are protected by a dynamic shield tech we haven't been able to crack. We're close, but its ability to adapt outstrips the speed of our current processors. Pathfinder, adding my processor to their program would no doubt make the difference. Ephra, I can help. Respectfully, this time you need my help. Respectfully, the Angara don't need anything from you. We take care of our own. What I meant was, let our scientists help with your program. Let my team join your effort. Hmm. What's up the chance for success? I'm offering. You should accept. Very well. I'm not stupid, and I love the Moshai. You're welcome on the mission. Thank you. The team will meet you at our base on Vold. They'll take you to the Get facility. Stay strong and clear. Goodbye. Jal said he wanted to see you. Just looking for attention, aren't you? Makes you wish for a tail that lets you hang upside down. Oh, maybe that's just me. Pathfinder, hey, I was wondering, could you put your stamp on a project? It's for me and Jarl to work on. Call it diplomacy if you have to put it in a budget bucket. Greenlight that research and it's all good. What's your read on the people we're working with? The squad and crew? They're all fine. You must have opinions. Your opinion's more important. What do you think of your people? Some people wonder how we make this team work. Some days, I'm one of them. It's a blur sometimes. I bet Lexi's flagging all kinds of psych warnings. Up to us to figure it out. That's why this is our ship. So we own it. Want to make it work. Just stopping in to show some interest, and see if it might be returned. Oh, flattered, Ryder. But I'm not into guys. Thanks, though. Still, answer me this. Would I be a one-night thing, or do I read his marriage material? In-laws and picket fences, for sure. See, I get that a lot. Mom said it was the hair. We'll talk later. I know it. are a few hundred thousand years ahead. Humans are catching up. Humans back home, maybe. You skipped class for 600 years. So, you've gained Ephra's trust. No easy feat. I still don't think he likes me. That's just his way. You should be more worried about the Rokar. Ephra made it seem like you had experience with them. I know their leader, Aksul. We studied together under the Moshai, <laughs> but unlike me, he was a good student. The best, actually. Then he knows about Remnant? He did. <laughs> it's a long story, 
Give me the short version. Aksul was captured by the Ket. He spent a year in a forced labor camp before he managed to escape. I can't imagine what he must have gone through. He has scars that would give you an idea. When Aksul returned, he no longer cared about the Remnant, or anything, except destroying the Ket. Why not join the Resistance? Aksul's not the type to follow orders. And I think he was bitter we weren't able to rescue him. So he formed the Rokar. We didn't give them much thought. But since your people arrived, his cause has grown. I convinced Ephra I'm not a threat. Maybe I can do the same with Axul. <laughs> I admire your courage. But Axul's dangerous. And he lacks Ephra's pragmatism. He'll make you want to kill him. I have to try. If Helios is to be your home, I guess you'll have to deal with the Rokar one way or another. There's a recluse on Havarul who escaped with Axul from the Ket. Her name is Tholdir. She might know how to contact him. I'll send you the nav point. is a wonder writer, and the Angara are so interesting. I hope we make it back. I want to delve and explore and who knows what else. Just don't hurt diplomatic relations, okay? Please, give me a little credit. Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. Liam, I signed off on that project. That's great, Pathfinder. Jala Maldorov, we got our gear. Costa, Ryder. We don't technically have uniforms, but this is a little casual. <laughs> Just convenience, swapping armor. You ready to go? Go. Right. The pattern on your pauldron? Family honorific. Can I wear the poncho? It's a Rofshin. And no. Why? Is it religious? Wait. What? It's personal. You're not allowed. Because of status or species? Maybe it's both. Mm, do all humans look alike? Some of you sound alike. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I know how this goes. Someone's getting offended, and someone else punched. That's why we're doing it here? It's an armor swap for answers. Stuff the diplomats, don't ask. I, my turn was earlier. Nexus info packets leave a lot out. I am sorry. Was this not sanctioned? Oh, you weaseling Adi. Nevertheless, Ryder? I hope you know what you're doing. I don't need the Nexus breathing down my neck. Relax. Jar won't complain to HR or whatever Tan thinks we report to. We were joking around and realized we didn't know how to insult each other. Or how not to. Some things are so ingrained they're invisible. We didn't even know the warning signs, so we got it over with. Now we won't do it accidentally. Like when we're trying to negotiate an outpost. Enough of his people want to shoot us now. Okay, I kind of get the intent. No harm, no foul. If Jar was offended, I'd be on the floor. I'll take that kind of honest any day. We have a lot to learn. That's part of what our team is for. <laughs> Better now than when people's lives are on the line. Yeah. 
And it was a time when Sid was afraid of space. We were traveling a lot, and one day she just woke up and realized there was nothing outside the shuttle walls. Happened more than once. She'd panic. I'd hold her for as long as it took. She doesn't even remember now. It was only for a month or two. Funny, huh? The things they don't remember. And you feel like it's up to you to hold on to it, or else it's just gone. And there's just something there that you know you're missing. Drac? Just hold on to it. Ryder. You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. That is a nice little piece of paradise the Angara have. Wouldn't mind seeing it again. I wouldn't mind either. Maybe we can have something like that too someday. We rescue that Moshai of theirs. Maybe they'll give us some tips. Got any stories or advice to share? Does a Pijack scratch its butt? Tell me more about fighting Ket. There's just something wrong about the Ket. The absolute single-mindedness. We can talk more later. Sure. How long does it take? Depends how you apply yourself. With your mind, you'd be adept in a few weeks. Did you hear the news from Eos? A sorry refugee showed up at the outpost. Only a few, but that's better than none. Bradley says there's an officer in charge, Hidaria. She could know where the Ark is. We'll head to Eos and see what she knows. Good. Rumor says Sarissa Theris was on the Asari Ark. Exactly who we need. Who's she? Probably the best commando strategist alive. Her biotic shields saved hundreds at the Battle of Kirkus. Apparently, Sarissa's acting as bodyguard to the Asari Pathfinder. She's probably got a plan out of this mess already. Well, someone's a fan. No, I... I just like... Look, we need someone with her experience, that's all. I'll take someone with that much experience. Another reason to find the Ark. When you're ready to look, we can catch Hidari at Prodromos. Wouldn't mind tagging along. Entering atmosphere, LZ in sight. Yeah. 
think we should head to the vault. Do some Have poking you sent around the update there. to our people on I Sounds I risky. Transports available. Good point. Emergency support for cat attack. What? Sorry, I'm clearly in the wrong place. Huh. You're that alien visitor that came to Aya asking about our vault. You've heard of me. Who hasn't? When strange new species turn up, reports spread fast. After the cat, can't be too careful. Luge Anson. Historian with the repository of history, Aya. Listen, if there's nothing you need, could you go away? I'm busy trying to get transport off this cursed planet. Why did you come here from Aya? Kieran's team found some remnant relics while digging around the old ruins. I was sent to collect them for the repository. It shouldn't have taken more than a day. But things never go according to schedule, do they? You don't seem to like Havarl very much. Havarl's other regions suit me just fine, but here... Oh no, I don't do well in this fierce wilderness. <clears throat> you think these shelters keep you safe? They don't. Woke up this morning and found a thorny vine wormed its way into my bunk. I'm stranded here because a branch pierced my shuttle's power core. You mentioned remnant ruins. Are there lots of remnant here? Yes. If you'd been out in the jungle, you might have seen some of it. We think the ruins were part of a vast remnant complex. We've seen evidence of hallways that wound through the area, both above and below the ground. Generations ago, our people took shelter in what we found here. That's how Palef was established. Were there no hostile remnant machines? None, according to the histories. We found artifacts, of course. Bits of things that we could study. But they say it was like moving into an empty home. I won't bother you further. Very well. Watch out for plants while you're out there. Vicious things. Reports didn't do this world justice. It's... ethereal. Director Addison? No personal appearance? It might have been an outpost. Thank you, but no. I prefer climate control to... these extremes. Given the planet's significance to the Angara, it's appropriate that we assist, but not place an outpost. And the stability you brought? I received a thank you from Aya. That may be the first time I've heard those words in Andromeda. After the cat and what they've seen of the Exiles, we had to be at our best. We've had precious few examples of that. Pathfinder might be getting close. Havarl helps. Outpost or not, we're gaining. We need another, but we're gaining. It's promising, and a lot of people have noticed. And there's another matter, a ceremonial one. A statement for the Archives. Is this really the time? Pathfinder was always a symbol. Like outpost flags hanging in the commons, the people need a connection to reality on the ground. Address them, Pathfinder. What did this mean? This is Havarl. I didn't find an outpost. I found Angara, and saw a piece of who they are. We're welcome to help here. It's not ours. It's all of ours. I think that makes the whole cluster closer to home. Into the books, Pathfinder. At us now. Ah, you'll be the Pathfinder then. Dr. McIntyre from the Nexus. Ryder, welcome to Havarl. She'll be more welcoming now that you put the vault back on track. The Angara invited us to monitor plant growth and study ruins out in the jungle. It's the chance of a lifetime. 
You know how Tavos found the monolith, right? Reincarnated memories? Aye, I heard. One for the textbooks. You believe him? But you're a scientist. Asari share thoughts and memories. Prothean text speaks in visions. Those are scientific facts. There's more to people than what can go under a microscope, lad. Be careful around those monoliths. There might be more stasis fields. We think they only affect Angara, but who knows? Oh, we know. Make no mistake. I have a check-in system ready. Whether young Farley remembers it when he's chasing butterflies is another matter. What does your team do here? Zera is our botanist. She'll be minding the plants and designing an artificial habitat for them. She also happens to be an engineer. Asari. One profession's never enough. Then there's young Farley. He's here for the insects. And you? I'm the xenoanthropologist. A fancy word for talking to the Angara about those ruins. And listening. I imagine you've spoken to Kieran Dahls already? She's the one who invited us, aye. Fussed over us, something terrible. But she's a fine lady, and hopefully a good colleague down the road. I plan to listen to her. Good luck, McIntyre. Safe journeys, Ryder. Pathfinder Ryder, Dr. Tsana Rilar, Xenobotanist for the Initiative, and my colleague, Dr. Eric Baumgarten. Xenogenetics. Pleasure to meet you. No offense, but you probably shouldn't be out here alone. I'm not alone. I'm with her. She's quite fierce. Your report of accelerated evolution and rapid growth of nature here caught our interest. We're analyzing everything we can for clues to replicate the effects on our own crops. Why would you want to do that? The planet was destroying itself. Only because things were out of control. If we learn to enhance the growth of plants and animals in non-destructive ways, we could end hunger. It would change everything for the Initiative. Our colonies could thrive virtually overnight. Since you repaired the vault, things are returning to normal, but too quickly for us. The accelerated life forms you want to study are dying off. Decaying. We're scrambling to scan and catalog everything before it's gone. We could use some help. Point me at the life forms you need. I'll do the rest. Anything mutated beyond its baseline growth cycle will aid our work. I'll provide the most promising genetic markers to scan for. Thank you for whatever help you can provide, Pathfinder. Rendezvous here when you're finished. fresh from the Nexus, and a few from my secret partners. Plan to build the first Angora Nexus trading company. Lone Star Enterprises. <laughs> Gotta remember where I started, you know. Hey, you wanna be an early investor? What do I get for investing? Today, great supplies. Tomorrow, who knows? escaped the cat with Axel, lives in this area. We're less likely to scare her if we bring Jal. Cat! I thought this would be boring.
Locked. I'll override it. Don't come any closer! Thaldir, I'm not here to hurt you. Don't touch me! I just want to help. I already helped myself. You did this to yourself? The cat. I can't go back. I won't. Oh. Don't push yourself. You'll make it worse. I've never met a human before. You're not like he described. You mean Exul? He saved me. Gave me a chance to live. And die on my own terms. I need to find him. I wanted to see him. One more. Mm, she's gone. Even in the end, she was devoted to him. Better update Jal. Jal. A Ket raiding party attacked Thaldir. She took her own life instead of being captured. I'm sorry. Damn the Ket. The only other person who might be able to reach Aksul is the Moshai. Another reason to rescue her. An alien, able to use Remnant. Never thought I'd see such a... ...thing. My aunt had a Remnant artifact she learned to open and close. But it took her many, many years I'd to achieve it. To she was never able to do it reliably. It took a great deal of concentration. Your wife helped you. Initiative researchers might benefit from scans of the mutated wildlife nearby. Hostiles ahead!
life forms in your immediate area for growth mutations, Pathfinder. Display accelerated growth markers. That's it. This is coming back to the Tempest. The Zingara carried more than weapons. They had research tech, data pads. Let's find out why. We're studying mutant wildlife too. They want to use it against us. The data pad mentions a camp. Up, dating known data. Mission parameters changing.
If possible, we could discover something new from what you found. We should take it for further analysis. Sam, what do you get from this? Analyzing. The Rokar took special interest in mutations that would poison a natural environment. Turn life into death for anyone living there. Like us. What are your instructions for this data, Pathfinder? Erase the whole computer, Sam. No one needs that knowledge. Acknowledged. Data elimination complete. Let's wrap things up and get back to our researchers. What have you brought us, Pathfinder? I got jumped by Rokar. They were researching harmful mutations, hoping to use them against us. I hope you put an end to their work. Do you have any of their data? May we see it? I erased everything. We don't need that kind of knowledge floating around. I was just curious to see the Rokar's idea of good science. We need to be better than them. This is about improving life, right? Exactly. Our work could benefit the Angara. Prove the Rokar wrong about us. I scanned all the mutated wildlife I could find. I hope it helps your research. We're going to be overwhelmingly busy, aren't we? Thank you for everything, Pathfinder. We'll get to work. All systems green. 